Now to Health Source 10 tonight. They are helping survivors heal and take back part of their lives that they lost. It is a different shade of pink for Breast Cancer Awareness Month or shading, we should say. Breast cancer survivors from as far away as Missouri came to Columbus to heal with new art. Art that symbolizes their journey. 10TV's Lacey Crisp explains P-Ink Day. In 2016, I was diagnosed with stage three breast cancer. I did 56 radiation treatments. These women just met, yet they know each other all too well. We became part of a club that we didn't exactly ask to be a part of, but I'm in that club and I'm going to embrace it and I'm going to embrace the people that are in it with me. Being a part of that club and the healing process. This is a way for them to take back their power because they're choosing their design. You know, a doctor chose how their scar was going to look. Letting them decide art over scars. We know that Tattooing itself is a form of self-expression. We know how important someone's physical appearance is to them. So anything that we can do to help someone reclaim their dignity, if that's been compromised at all, we're more than willing to do. J. Brett Prince is co-owner of Gehanna Tattoo Shop. He, along with the artists who work at his shop, donated their space and talents for a day to make these women whole again. It was an amazing experience. You can watch the um, growth right in front of your eyes. Mendy Stockwell had a double mastectomy. I'm done, I'm cancer free. But she doesn't feel done. Right now I feel kind of undone and I feel like I'll be finished. She and 14 other women received tattoos through the P Inc event. I literally felt like everything that you're told that makes you a woman was taken from me. Beauty, like tattoos, so it's been a struggle, is more than skin deep, which is why Tabitha Atkins chose a mermaid design for her tattoo. There's always beauty in the depths. Sometimes you have to look a little harder, but there's always beauty. Well, these women gain confidence through taking control of their bodies. They don't want more to join their club and wants everyone to take control of their health. Early detection is key. In Gahanna, Lacey Crisp, 10TV News.